Look at me. Look at me. This is your final chance to tell me the truth. And I know exactly whose dropship mech warrior Ezra left on. When did he first make contact with Wolf's Dragoons? When did your command learn that you harbored a traitor to the clan? I never thought he would betray us. I have said for days now, yes, Ezra was frustrated. Just like everybody else that was left behind. You lie. Lie! You helped elevate a freeborn spheroid to mech warrior status. You harbored a traitor within your own star. And your negligence cost Smoke Jaguar a world that it bled for to secure. My friend died taking this world. Don't think for a second excuses. I will have none of it. You have proven yourselves unworthy of your station within Beta Galaxy. And who gave you such authority? My Khan. I did not know of your return. Perhaps you might have known, if you were not preoccupied with deflecting blame and harassing my warriors. This star was provisionally assigned to Zeta Galaxy to assist with hunting down the ISF, not tangle with the Nova Cats. Are you denying your own culpability and the events that led to this mess, Star Colonel? Hmm? Nick. The Nova Cats official report claims a lone warrior violated Zalbrigand and initiated a melee. At no point did they allude to mech warrior Ezra's defection. We will not dispute this point. It will go down as a tactical error on behalf of an unnamed warrior and nothing more. There are more pressing matters at hand. Has the Armada returned? Will the invasion resume? Afchild. It has and it will. We now head to Luthien. Capital of the Draconis Combine. Operation Dragon Slayer has united Clan Novacat and Smoke Jaguar for one purpose. To sink our teeth and claws into House Karita's seat of power. Despite the promise of honorable combat through their code of Bushido, time and again these samurai of the Kiritan regime have proven themselves no better than Valisek and his band of cutthroats. Because of this, no batch all will be given for this world. The Remembrance will immortalize today as the day that Kerensky's vengeance came for the tyrants of the Draconis Combine. And that there was nothing they could do to flee from our justice. All Smoke Jaguar Novacat forces have touched down on Luthien. Demi Presenter Akari, what forces would you expect House Karita to deploy against us? Difficult to tell, but I estimate six to nine battle mech regiments. Most of that will come from the Luthien Defense Force. 
But the real threat will come from whatever house units Theodore Kurita is able to muster in time for the battle. Anticipate multiple regiments from the elite Swords of Light and the Genyosha. You will also have to contend with the Izanagi and the Otomo, the royal guards of House Kurita's ruling family. But it is unlikely they will venture far from the Imperial Palace. Will they have mercenary support? No, Star Colonel. The Coordinator's Death to Mercenaries edict forbids them from stepping foot on Luthien. This is it, then. House Kurita's final stand. Hi. That is highly likely. If Luthien falls, the entire Combine will be thrown into chaos. Kerensky's justice has finally come for them. Star Commander Jaden, we will soon be called up for deployment. There will be no distractions here. So see to it that your star is fully prepared for multiple consecutive deployments. We will not rest until this world is ours. I will see it done, Star Colonel.